Welcome back to the Home Zone Reunion. I'm Dean Dragoon, joined by all six of the remaining home zoners. We've covered some of your favorite moments already, but since no questions are off limits, we're going to have to clear the air regarding some of the confrontations that happened during the experience as well. Roger, Bryce, early in the experiment, you two clashed. What happened? 100% Dean. We were all just barely getting to know each other, and Bryce dared to disturb my slumber. Okay. Okay, I hear you. Let's at least hear my side of the story before we just say, I disturbed your slumber, right? Yeah, 100%. Go ahead. Okay, thank you. Thank you. So firstly, there were no rules in the home zone regarding slumber. <laughs> Honestly, that's important. That's really important. And by the way, I do apologize, Dean, for this drama being on your show. I take partial ownership. I feel as though it's me who deserves an apology. Um, I think it's common sense not to disturb my slumber. I did not know you were slumbering. Okay. Come on. Bro, everyone knew about his slumber. I did not know. I did not know. You heard tell of the prophecies. A hundred percent you heard tell of the prophecies. Honestly? I, I pay no heed to prophecy. Now, Bryce, to be clear, are you saying that prophecy... Prophecy is for fools, Dean. Honestly, oh. if you want my honest opinion... In the spirit of the experiment, the experience, soothsayers sit atop a brittle pyramid scheme of belief. Oh my god, are you serious? Come on, Bryce, come That's, on. That's... Hey, I'm just saying what everyone at home is thinking. Why would you think that that is something that you, you know say? I come from a family of oracles. A hundred percent. I am and here not you are, attacking your I'm family. I have television against your saying family. Saying that my family is hey, wrong. Come on, come on your family. What are you doing? If I were attacking your family, I would say it directly. You can trust me to speak my mind. And I won't wrap it up in a riddle. Oh, no. See, this is why we don't get along, Dean. First, he disturbs my slumber. Then he insults the five augers. All while he, himself, 100% dabbles in dark magics. We're going to have to call Okay, him. but he's, he's attacking my conjurations, Dean. And he's insulting my incantations. Honestly, these sorceries are only forbidden because of the cowardice of the Elder Mages. Whoa. Honestly, when we're having this conversation, I think we often forget that human aspect of the equation. When you and Brayden summoned Ellie Thoker, Lord of Fire... You nearly plunged the realm into a thousand years of torment. And seeing that, 100% hurt my feelings. I didn't think of it like that. When I attempted to harness the power of the Ancient One, I didn't consider your perspective. You're right. I'm sorry. Okay? That means a lot. Thank you. Moving on. Matt, you killed three contestants on camera and have been indicted for first-degree murder. How do you feel about the trial? Not very good, Dean. Makes sense. 